There's five acids in your body that are horrible. One of them is lactic acid, and it's produced by exercising, and it can really tear your body apart if it gets too high. Then you got uric acid that's in your urine, and when that goes up, you get swollen hands, swollen feet, clammy or sweaty, frequent urination, congested heart failure, and your hair starts to follow. And then there's blood acid. And if that blood acid goes up, that they take a, it's called an arterial prick. They take it at 7 o'clock in the morning and pull some blood out and check your acid. And if that's up, that's that big thing people call rheumatism, fibromyalgia, and all of these diseases. They ache no matter what they do. If they sit down, they ache. They stand up, they ache. They wish they were dead. It causes so much acid in the body. And then there's saliva acid. That's the acid that you feel puffed, bloated, gastric, burping, farting. And it makes you feel sick all the time. You eat something, you feel horrible. You don't eat, you feel horrible. So your body's getting too acidy on the inside. The last one is called body acid. Now, that's the amazing one. That's the last one usually to drop. And when that drops, that's the acid that tells your pancreas you're starving when you're not. So you see those kids in Biafra, they've got a big belly. Well, how could they be starving? Because the acid is high. And it tells the pancreas, save all the food and water we can. It saves everything to try to hold weight. So even if you don't eat something, you gain weight because you drank something. Those acids you want to start getting down. And as soon as they start dropping, you start feeling good. First of all, headaches disappear. You've got a lot of energy. You start dropping weight because every 10 pounds you're over, by experiment, they found that you die one year early. So if you're 500 pounds over, that's an extreme, you'd die 50 years early. So you're going to die pretty young. But let's say you're just 50 pounds over. That's five years early you could have died when you could have been enjoying your grandchildren and everything else.